Okay, now we'll go to part two of, um, of the blog, which is the whole name for this blog is not just quotes to live by. It's quotes to live by and actions to take. And my whole focus, my whole thrust of teaching, it's the actions we take that are so important. It's the action. It, putting it into practice, feeling it out, living it, that changes everything in our life. So, so my quote was, may this be for the highest good. And I, I don't know where that came from, so I can't give credit. It came from higher power. And so the action to take, it occurs to me the action to take will be to offer you what I do with it, how I live with this quote, and see how it works for you in your day. So you basically go through your day, and when you decide you need something, or want to do something, or somebody should be doing something, or you should be doing something, you know, any of those shoulds or ought to or want it different, any of those situations, and we have many, many in our days, apply this statement to it first. We'll say, you know, I think my, whatever, I think my mother should be different than she is, and she's not. And then you, you think, okay, may, th may this be, may this be for the highest good. Whatever this situation is between her and me, may it be for the highest good. I don't know what the highest good is of this relationship. I think I know. I think it should be different. I think it should be peaceful. All mothers and daughters should be peaceful. And it isn't. So may it be for the highest good. I just offer this whole situation up. We'll see how it goes. So that's how I use it. And when I give Reiki, I always say before I give Reiki to anyone, it is be for the highest good. And again, it, um, you know, the teaching in, in Reiki, as I understand it, is that you move the personality aside, the person giving Reiki moves your personality aside, and you let Reiki in, you let Reiki do it. You don't decide, you know what's best for the person. So, may this be for the highest good is a perfect statement in that situation. But it really does run through me pretty well all day. And it allows me to, in humility, to realize I don't know what the best outcome for any situation is. And so I invite you to play with it and give me some feedback. Uh, write to me in the blog. Let's uh, see the notation of the site address below. And until next time, peace to you.